Hello again, YouTuber. This is your host, Samurai 7 I just want to make a video in response to a story that I found out earlier this week. And this is regarding a story that happened in North Fort Myers, Florida. And there was, it, looks, it seems that there was an incident that happened between two co-workers at a restaurant known as Cactus Jack. And apparently there are, well, people are saying that that the person who recorded this video, a video of the incident um, by the man, a man by the name of Orlando Ortega. People are saying that this man had punched a woman, punched a woman in this video who was going, was basically going wild and acting like a straight up wild hyena trailer rat. He's, she was basically um, throwing racial slurs, um, dropping F-bombs and all that. And also him, her telling him to get the hell out of her, out of the restaurant when she's not even the owner of the restaurant. She's not even an owner of it. She's just a co-worker. She's just a waitress there. I can't believe that there's people, that there's people out here in, who who want to act like this. I think that this behavior is going to get somebody somewhere in life when it's not. And another thing about this that really pisses me off is the fact that is that the owner. The owner of the restaurant, her name is Jane Thursfield, she said that the video does not tell the whole story. And she said that the lady in the video was was hit by the man and had blood on the face. Um, but if you watch the video closely, there is no blood on her face. There is no marks on her face. There's nothing. So a punch, and people are saying that Ortega is a boxer. So if he's a boxer, there's no doubt in my mind that one punch from this dude is going to leave some marks. It's going to leave some marks on her face. But she ain't got no marks on her face. This is probably, she's probably just another wild hyena trailer rat who will do something, who will put marks on her face and try to put the blame on, on some innocent black or Hispanic person. Then the Hispanics, they have it hard just as much as we black people have it hard here in this country. I feel bad. I feel bad for, for this that this happened to this young man. I feel bad this happened. And now this man, he got let go. He's no longer working there. But the woman in that video, she's still working there. White privilege is freaking disgusting. It's disgusting. And it's sad that there's people that people like this, they get to roam around and do the hell do whatever the hell they want to do. And they want to live and believe that they, they can just do whatever the hell they want to do. Can't stand people like that. I really can't. And that's why I do all I can to stay away from people like that. Yo, know, and that's not mature behavior. You don't just get to just do whatever you want to do. You don't. If you want to act like that, then nobody's going to respect you. No one's going to. So I'm going to say this as a word of advice to anyone who's watching me. If you want to try to live that kind of behavior, that kind of mentality, then you're going to find yourself by yourself for the rest of your life. And for this woman right here in this video, I hope that she ain't married. I hope she's not. I hope that she ain't got no boyfriend or nothing. I hope that she ain't sleeping with no guy or nothing. Because I sure as hell would not want to sleep with no woman like that. No, hell no. I would not want to be having sex with some woman with this kind of immature mentality. Feel like they can just do whatever the hell they want to do. It's the act of a, of a teenager. That's basically what that is. So watching that video, I didn't see a woman. I saw a wild hyena trailer rat. That's what I saw in that video. And to that man, if you're watching this video, um, I'm sorry you had to go through that. I really am sorry that you had to go through that. And don't give up. There are plenty of places out there. There are many jobs out there in the world that you can find. And I'm sure you probably found found yourself a nice job that you can you can enjoy and you can move on with your life, and you can look back from this, and you stood you stood your ground. And I have to say, and I'm proud of you. I'm very proud of you, young man, for sticking up for yourself. You stood your ground. And we as men, we really need to do that in, in incidents like this. Stand on our ground, the females like that. And I hope that it'll be it'll be in the case in the future. That we'll stand on our ground against wild high the trailer rats. Now, that's all i got to say about this. Feel free to like, comment, and favorite my video, or feel free to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys later.